Hey everybody, the Gaming Guru 51 here, and welcome to Pick and Play. This is where I pick a game out of my game collection and play it for you guys. So this week, we're not playing Banjo Tooie. Oh no, we're playing the better game. <laughs> I'm laughing as I said that. This is Banjo Pilot. I've never played this game before. I have heard of it before, but I've just never played it. And uh, we're gonna see how it is. Apparently, this is a Banjo Kazooie racing game, which I think is really weird, but. Okay, well, we could be Banjo Kazooie, we could be Mumbo Jumbo, or a Jinjo. I'll, I'm gonna pick Kazooie, because I always like the, you know, the, the, the lightweight characters. This is weird. Welcome to the Bottles Grand Prix. Can you master the tracks and win all four cups? Each cup consists of four races with points awarded to, for each race. The better you finish, position the more points you get. Rack up the points, and at the end of the four races, you'll be invited to compete in a one-on-one -on -one duel against the reigning champion. All right. I guess we're going to the Honeycomb Cup here. The Honeycomb Cup is the easiest of all available cups, even for a novice pilot such as yourself. It should be a piece of cake to complete. You can press the R while turning to enable the sharp return. Sure. Okay. This is weird. Spiral Mountain? I know Spiral Mountain. This reminds me of a lot of, uh, of Diddy Kong Racing, actually. It definitely reminds me of a lot of Diddy Kong Racing, and I'm not sure if I like that or not. I'm not a, the biggest fan of Diddy Kong Racing in the world. Probably because I never actually played that much of it as a kid. I didn't grow up with Diddy Kong Racing. I grew up with, you know, Mario Kart 64. And uh, this is a really weird game. I can fly up and down, which is pretty neat, but I don't know how that's going to help me if I'm racing. Get out of here! I, I'm guessing I have the equivalent of what would be a red shell, and that'll just destroy everything. I got some more of those. Oh, they're, uh, they're, they look like eggs? I don't actually know. And luckily, I don't get rid of my item if I get a new item, which is pretty solid. Dude! Don't do that to me. What do you think this is? And I got a note. Not sure what the heck that does, but we'll probably end up finding out. I'm in third place. I, oh yeah, this is the easiest. Dude! You can't just put blocks everywhere. Just getting in the way. Come on, give me something else that can help me. Oh, I got a gold feather. Get out of here. Everybody just get on the heck out of here. Where's first place? Oh, that's a boost. Oh, God. No. No, I'm a no I am the best racer. This is the first course in the first cup. Good Lord, man. Will this help? And I scrape second place. Cool. All right. Well, well, of course, Gruntilda got first place. No surprises there. I'm guessing it's the same like in Mario Kart. If you get the most amount of points, you win the game. Oh yeah, and the game's got to save, of course. Jinx, Jinxies Dunes. Not sure I remember that place from Banjo Kazooie. Oh, whew. okay. I got a boost. I got a boost. I enjoy boosting. It's fun. Oh, uh, what do I got here? Oh, I wasted that item. Probably should. Oh, no! Give me the boost! Give me the boost! Yeah, this is definitely like Diddy Kong Racing if it was for the Game Boy. I actually think they remade Diddy Kong Racing for the DS, if I'm not mistaken. I remember because I remember I was going to buy it one time when I was a kid, but I never actually did. Don't remember. I think I'm, I don't know what game I bought instead that day. Then again, I have so many games, it's hard for me to keep track of what I actually, you know, bought and what time, you know? I don't know, it's weird because usually I can remember. Dude, don't do this! At least the boost is kind of, like, kind of nullified the damage I took there, but. Yeah, to say this is a novice course, yeah, I'm not getting first. Well, I am in first now, but that will change. And I got three notes! How many notes do I need to do a thing? I have no idea. We'll say the game itself is a. Uh, it reminds me of Mario Kart Super Circuit as well, the graphics wise. Not. I mean, it is a Game Boy Advance game. I don't know when this game came out. I probably should have paid attention on the starting screen. I'm pretty sure it would tell me. No, don't do this. And of course, the boost didn't help me there. Okay. 
I'm pretty sure I could have used that. I'm in eighth place. I am a disgrace. And why does the cart go bad if I'm in bad terrain? I guess they have to slow you down somehow. Oh, first place. Come on, give it to me right here. Come on, right here. Do it. Fantastic. First place. Nice. First place. I dig it all every day of the year. 58 points. Or not, twice for something else. And wow, Gratilda got fourth place this time, which means she's in last. Or no, that's not the combined race points. This is the combined race points. Cool. Moving on to the next course. Ooh, Freeze Easy Peak. That place I remember from, you know, Banjo-Kazooie. I gotta stop saying that, because I know this game even came out after Banjo-Tooie, if I'm not mistaken. I would imagine it's a Game Boy Advance title. So I would imagine it come out after Banjo-Tooie. Sorry, I'm just listening to the music. That, uh, no, that muffled... Not muffled, that's not the right word I'm looking for. I'm looking for... What word am I looking for instead of muffled? I guess it would be that because, you know, it's using the Game Boy Advance sound font. Trying to re replicate, you know, Game Boy... or N64 titles. Mario 64 had that same uh, kind of thing, too. And I'm going to use this to gain some solid speed. Even though I can't control my character. But at least we're in third now. Okay. Alright, we can do this. This isn't bad. We're in third place. We'll be just fine, hopefully. I'll get myself a note. And then we'll just make those really sharp turns, you know? Look at that snowman up there. He's just, you know, not moving at all. It's great. Oh, God. What just happened? I don't even know what happened to me. I took damage somehow. Must have gotten hit by something. What is that? Are those whales? Or, yeah, they're whales. Why are whales here? It's so cold. Banjo! You gotta let Kazooie win. Come on now, we're you guys are best buds. Like, what are you doing? Hooray, we're at the final lap. And I'm gonna lose because I took damage. Let's just do this. Get out of here. Banjo! Dude, what is everybody doing here? Go away! Get out of here, all of you. Jeez. So much is happening right now and I cannot tell because the game looks weird. Wow, I'm going to lose this. Are you serious? If there's any chance to gain victory, now would be the, the time to do it, you know? Now would be the best time to get an item to win the game. Give it to me right here. Yes! Will this give me the game, or am I going to lose it? Yeah, I lost it. Well, I certainly tried my best. Good lord. If I don't get first place in this cup... I mean, I guess in Mario Kart 64, when I did that pick and play, I didn't get first place either. Or not with Double Dash. I don't remember anymore. But we're winning by one, which means I have to get first place in the next course. Or Mumbo has to suck. Hellfire Peaks. Alright, moving on. Don't think I remember this area from Kazooie, you know. But it looks pretty sweet, though. Not gonna lie. Looking pretty solid. It's nice and, you know... Nice and fiery. Come on now, you can't hit a poor bird. All right, I'm get. Oh, there's a. That was that a dragon? I saw a dragon just now. That was pretty cool. This course in design. Oh, yes. See exactly. That was what I was thinking. That item can be used to hit other projectiles, so I don't die. Which I guess should have been the secret to winning this whole time, right? Give me another one of those. Yes, I have two of them, which means I'm safe. I wonder if you can hold them, or do you just... You have to... Okay, so you can't hold them. You can only use them once you press the button. So, good to know. However, I need to gain speed to catch up to this guy. And I did. Very nice. And you're... Seriously? What... What the heck just hit me just now? Good lord. Final lap already? Jeez. Alright. Will this hit him? Or do something? Yes, it does. And I hit my own thing. Are you serious? Jeez, what is happening right now? Uh, it's so fast. Come on, I gotta win this. For the sake of... You just took my item. What is wrong with you? I'm in fifth place, fourth place. Come on, we got this. Come on, third. No! Oh, dude, are you serious? I lost it. I lost. 
Oh, by 1.2. That sucks. Jeez, man. Good job, you've clocked up enough points to claim the Silver Cup. Now defeat the champion and the cup's yours. I suppose you're wondering what you need to do here. Let me tell you, you meet your opponent high up in the sky, use your weapons to shoot them down before they shoot you down. Keep an eye out on your green energy bar. If this reaches zero, it's game over. Thank you, Bottles. I appreciate. Kazooie Clash. So it's like a battle mode? I'm fighting a Kazooie? Oh, I get it. I can use items to hit them. Oof. Okay. I don't understand. Oh, I see. So basically, we switch sides. He tries to hit me down. And I get it. Ooh, okay. Okay. But I see that I see what's happening here. This is weird. Okay, now we switch sides. This isn't gonna help me here. All you gotta do is keep hitting him, right? That's it. I don't know what that's gonna do, but oh, you can throw eggs. Well, tell me how you do that now. Gee whiz. So now, how do I throw eggs? How do I... Can I throw eggs, like... Okay. This is really weird. I just have to admit right now. How do you throw the eggs behind? Unless that's an item you get. Oh. <laughs> well, that certainly did the trick. Come on. We can win this. This is easy. Literally the piece of cake. Yeah, get out of here. I think we did it. Yeah, we did. Yeah! This is okay. Great. And we got the silver prize. Not bad. Okay, that was rather fun. Well done. You're the new champion of the Honeycomb Cup. Well, I'm actually the, the silver winner, not the gold winner. Okay, well, I think that's enough of this game for now. Well, no, forever. What I, maybe I'll come back to this on my own time. It's a weird game. <laughs> but that's going to be it, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. And uh, we'll play definitely another game, of course. But, um, yeah, with that being said, thank you guys so very much for watching. And I will see you guys next time for the next Pick and Play episode. I will see you guys then.